This video is going to review the muscles of the posterior trunk. Uh, I have two pictures up here. We're also going to use the arm pictures. So I'll be going back and forth so you can see or identify where all of these are located. First one is the teres major, which is here on the cadaver. And teres major, again, it's going to be the bigger of the two, is located here, located here on this torso model. model. Uh, remember that teres minor is one of the four rotator cuff muscles, and we'll look at the other three in a second. Above this teres minor is the, and again it's deep, is the infraspinatus. The infraspinatus. On this one you can't see the supraspinatus, but you can also see the infraspinatus here. Where you can see the supraspinatus and infraspinatus is on the arm model. So this is your deltoid, this is the spine of your scapula, this is the supraspinatus, this is the infraspinatus. You can also see on this model the fourth rotator cuff muscle, and that is the subscapularis. So here you're looking at the anterior portion of the scapula. Again, the anterior portion of the scapula. So the subscapularis, the supraspinatus above the spine, infraspinatus below the spine. And again, your fourth rotator cuff muscle goes back to that teres minor, which is the smaller of the two. The trapezius, pretty easy to find. Here you see it. Again, you're looking at the superficial muscles on this side of the cadaver. You can also see part of it here. It comes down. Obviously, it would come down a lot farther. It looks like a kite, okay, to that spine of, this, of the scapula. And then we have the rhomboid major and minor. You can really only see those on the cadaver. Here, it's a very deep muscle. This is the rhomboid minor. This is the rhomboid major. Then down here, you have this very flat muscle called the latissimus dorsi. You also see it on this muscle here. This muscle becomes pretty significant in swimmers because uh, when they pull their arm through the water, that muscle uh, develops a lot of strength. And the erector spinae, you, it's very deep muscles that run up and down at the back, so you can't really see those very well on any of the models. So again, let me go through that again. We'll just focus on the muscles that we can see on these two pictures. You have the teres minor, which is a rotator cuff muscle, the teres major, you have the infraspinatus, you have the trapezius, which runs here, you have the rhomboid minor, the small group right here, and the rhomboid major right here, you have the latissimus dorsi, and again you can't see the erector spiny muscles that run through here. On these pictures you can see the deltoid, you can see the supraspinatus, you can see the infraspinatus, and on the anterior portion of the scapula, you can see the subscapularis. So again, let me go through those again. You have the teres minor, a rotator cuff muscle, the teres major, the infraspinatus, the trapezius, the latissimus dorsi, the rhomboid minor, the rhomboid major. You have the supraspinatus, you have the infraspinatus, and you have the subscapularis. This time, going through more of them that you can see on this model, you have the deltoid, you have the teres minor, you have the teres major, you have the infraspinatus, and again you have the trapezius. You can see the rhomboid minor, the rhomboid major, then you have the supraspinatus, the infraspinatus, and the subscapularis. One more time. You have the teres minor, the teres major, the infraspinatus, the trapezius, the rhomboid minor, the rhomboid major, and the latissimus dorsi. You also have the supraspinatus, the infraspinatus, and the subscapularis. This time I'm going to point to the muscle and you're going to identify it. If you need to use the list at first, that's fine, but you should be able to do this. You should be able to do this without the list. Again, say it out loud, it helps you spell.
again, let me go through them one more time. Trapezius, infraspinatus, teres minor, teres major, latissimus dorsi, rhomboid minor, rhomboid major. Over here, the same muscles, trapezius, teres minor, teres major, infraspinatus, latissimus dorsi. Supraspinatus, infraspinatus, subscapularis. This time, one more time on your own, identify the muscle.